OMG! Her skin changes color. That is pretty scary. I wouldn't know how to react if someone just turned blue in front of me. I'd think they were dying. I'd probably ring an ambulance. Hello everybody, I'm Yami, and can you imagine if every time you felt an emotion, your skin changed color to represent it? Well, that's exactly what happens in today's Gacha Story. This one is called My Skin Changes Color With My Emotions. And this one is by Seagull Rocks. I'm gonna leave a link in the description for the original. Do make sure to go and check that out. But this would be a serious negative trait to have. Can you imagine if you were out with your family and friends and you felt sad and your skin turned blue and everyone started asking you questions. I would hate that. That would be so awkward. Now let's get into the story to see what happens to this girl. Oh, we have some scientists. It's working. Mommy, daddy. Mia, you can't be in here. Daddy and I are working. But we will play with you as soon as we're done. Pinky promise. Pinky promise. Oh, she's so happy. But wait, what? She was really happy. She ran away and the mom falls over. Mommy? Don't move, Mia. It's going to blow up. Give me my necklace. Run. What about you? I've twisted my leg while falling. I think it's broken. Now go. Uh oh. Yeah, it's definitely going to explode. Also, how did she break her leg like that? That was crazy. She just fell. Why did she fall? What's happening, daddy? Take this and run as fast as you can. Yes, girl, run. Oh, wow. The lab just blew up like that. Giant explosion. Is she okay? She doesn't look okay. She's gone all gray. I've never seen a gacha character go gray before. That's concerning. Oh, but she's alive. That's good. What happened? Why is my skin a weird color? Oh, she's gone blue. That's how we know she's sad. I've been walking for miles. Where am I? Oh, hello. Woman in a car. Please don't tell me she gets knocked over. That always happens in gacha stories. And I'm like, did you not see the car? Why did you just walk into the road? Is that a child? Excuse me? Why are you out here so late? My mommy and my daddy died, so I tried to find a police station. Well, I can take you to one. Really? Yeah. We'll have to put her in foster care then. Actually, can I take her? Of course, let me get the paperwork. The radiation from the nuclear explosion made her skin change color with her emotions. What, is this like a normal common thing? Does this happen all the time? How did they work that out so fast? But I don't want my skin to change color. How come nobody is overreacting to this? Yeah, this is a pretty serious condition. Why does nobody care? It's happened once before in a different nuclear explosion. All right, this is neutral. We have happy when she turns yellow. Sad when she's blue, of course. We've got angry. She's red. You won't like her when she's angry. When she's annoyed, she goes orange. And when she's disgusted, she goes green. Shocked is purple. In love is pink. Is in love an emotion? It's okay. Let's go buy you some new clothes. Yay! I don't feel comfortable showing my skin. Hey, it's okay. I think you're beautiful. Thanks. Do I have a daddy? Uh, not exactly. Where's my daughter? Another mummy? Stacy, can I talk to you for a second? Yes, Stacy, you have some explaining to do. This child keeps changing colors. It's really strange. Why does she have yellow skin? Well, I'm glad that you've adopted her. 10 years later, she's now 17 and she's so angry her alarm's gone off. Me, every morning. Okay, she's happy because she's got her clothes on. She's looking good. Now for makeup. Oh wow, she's just covered up her skin with the makeup. That was a good idea. I never thought of that. I don't know why. That makes sense. Now for school. Let me catch you up. My name is Mia and this is my story. My skin changes color with my emotions if you couldn't already tell. No one knows my secret except for my adopted parents. This is where my story starts. Wait, did her story not start with the nuclear explosion? Why is it just starting now? There's her mums. Bye. Bye. Bye, sweetie. And three, two, one. I forgot my backpack. Where is Senpai? This is Leo. He's Mia's boy best friend. He's shy, loyal, but trustworthy. And he secretly likes Mia. Senpai! Hey, Mia. Oh, he calls her Senpai. That's cute. Oh, gosh. You scared me, Leo. Sorry, not sorry. Let's sit down. Finally. It's lunchtime. Uh-oh, we have just fallen into a very angry looking girl. What the heck? Don't cry, don't cry. My makeup will run and they'll find out about my skin. I hurt myself so bad. I... Uh-oh, where she's been crying, the makeup has rubbed away from her eyes and her skin is blue. Girl, you've been exposed. Now your entire face is blue. OMG, her skin changes color. That is 
pretty scary. I wouldn't know how to react if someone just turned blue in front of me. I'd think they were dying. I'd probably ring an ambulance. I went home early that day and I just said I splashed paint on myself. But where did the paint come from? I don't think it's a believable story. Everyone knows your little secret. How did they find out? I felt so alone. But Leo stuck with me through it all. We have skipped a week and Leo is going to tell her his secret. I guess it's time. Hey, Mia. Hey, Leo. Look, I've got to tell you something. Sure. What is it? Oh, she's shook right now. Look, I've liked you for two years now and I finally worked up the courage to tell you. Leo, I... Oh, he's just gone for it. What a legend. Sorry, are you okay? I'm fine, but that was my first kiss. I'm sorry, I'm so stupid. No, she's gone back for more. She likes it. Oh, I like this character's hair. Hello. Look at her. She's so happy walking around the school. She's got herself a boyfriend. I'm surprised you didn't recognize me. It can't be. You miss me? Jesse. it's so good to see you, Mia-chan. How was Japan? Amazing. This is Jesse, Mia's girl best friend. She's kind, funny, and adventurous. She went to live in Japan two years ago, but kept in touch with Mia the entire time. But why didn't she tell Mia that she was coming back if they kept in touch? Strange. What's up with your hair? I didn't brush it today. Casual thing to ask your friend. What's going on with your hair, girl? Looks trash. All right, Saturday, we're hanging out on the beach. Oh yeah, looks great. Relaxing, got a starfish. Hey Mia, when am I gonna meet that boyfriend of yours? You're always talking about him. Hey Mia, well how convenient, he just walks into the scene. Leo, what are you doing here? Well, I was on my way back from my cousin's pool party and I saw you, so I wanted to come say hi. Don't worry, you'll do fine on your test. I know you've studied really hard. Thanks for the pep talk, babe. Carolyn, can't you set me up with him? Guess what I got, tickets to the the biggest party of the year. Thank you so much, babe. I'll see you at 8 p.m., okay? Okay. I'll probably look a lot different tonight. I wanna try a new look. Okay. I have a plan that will ruin Mia's life and help you get with Leo. All right, we are at the party. It is lit. Where's Leo? Where is Leo? Where's he gone? He's not here. Is he in this room? Oh my gosh, what is happening? Is he cheating? Mia? Oh, why did he have to be a cheater? So sad. Coming from someone with lots of experience with relationships, you should talk to him. Maybe it was a misunderstanding. Girl, she walked in on her boyfriend kissing someone else. I don't know how you can explain yourself out of that. But I saw them kissing. Maybe she forced him. You won't know unless you talk to him. You're right. As always. Come on, let's go watch Mean Girls. I promise you, it's the truth. Nothing crazy happened between me and Carrie. My heart belongs to you. I guess I believe you. Leo, can I talk to you in private? No. Please, just for a minute. Then will you leave me alone? Yes. I'll be right back, babe. I don't trust Carrie. So? I'm pregnant. And you're the father. Girl, what? You just, you kissed. That's not how it works. What? That dirty liar. How could you let this happen? Five minutes later. Hey, babe. Don't hey, babe me. You've got Carrie pregnant. Wait, Mia, it's not what it sounds like. No, I'm done with second chances. Oh, this is very dramatic. He's fuming. He's smashing his feet on the ground like an angry rabbit. Sweetie, it's time for school. I'm not going today. I understand. She's so sad. She's going on a very sad walk. Oh my gosh, a boy. I'm so sorry about that. Wow, they really injured themselves from that fall. It's okay, I'm fine. She just carries around bandages in her pocket, apparently. What about your face? Oh yeah, she even had a band-aid. Convenient, a walking first aid kit. Thanks. Do you wanna walk with me? Sure. We had a lot of fun that day with concussions that they got from crashing into each other at speed. I don't know if they should be out having fun with head injuries. Oh, they got ice cream. And they went to the beach. We started hanging out a lot. We went to the beach almost every day. You know, you're not like most girls, Mia. Not just because of your skin, but your personality. And that's why I like you. You don't care about money or fame. You're just you. We loved spending time together. And we also both loved music. Hello? She really was pregnant. Mia! Don't go near her. Who are you? Her boyfriend. So, 
You finally moved on. Babe, we have to get home now if we want to be on time for that dinner party. Hey Jax, why did you tell Leo that you were my boyfriend? Is he not your boyfriend? I thought he was. I just didn't want him bugging you because of what you've been through. Anyways, why does your skin turn pink when you're near me? It means that I'm excited. Okay, I've gotta go now. Bye. Oh, she's gone home and she's thinking about him. I think I'm in love again. Oh, she's thinking about being with him. He does treat her good though. A lot better than the last boyfriend. I think I'm in love again. It's Jax. I didn't think it could be true. So, when are you gonna confess to him? Uh, well, the doorbell has rung. He's here. Maybe now's the time. Hey, shorty. I think I'm in love. I've gotta go. Bye. Well, don't tell me. Go tell him. He started walking away. He's so confused. He knocks on your door. You answer it and then you run away. He's not gonna think that you love him. He's gonna think that you hate him. Oh, well, she's been pushed outside. I think I'm in love again. Oh, bless them. Five months later. Uh-oh, she's tripping on a rock. Why is this girl always falling over? Are you okay? Yeah, I think I just need a bandage for my eye. Let's go then. Where's her first aid kit? I thought she always carried one around for moments like this. Jump on. Time for a piggyback ride. I'm gonna go get us some ice cream. Okay. Well, her eye healed real quick. Five minutes later. Who in the world are these people? people. They're gonna experiment on her? I got the ice cream. Huh? Mia? He's dropped his ice cream. He's shut. Uh-oh. What is happening here? You're finally awake. Mom? How are you alive? It doesn't matter. Can you get me out of here? Oh, my sweet child. I'm a scientist. And that means I experiment on things. And by that, I mean I'm experimenting on you. You were my first experiment from the moment you were born. Her mom's evil. But your dad didn't know it. I planned the entire thing. I planned the explosion, but I wasn't expecting that your dad would die in the process. Remember when I gave you my necklace before I died? It was the key for my plan. You took it off, but I managed to get my hands on it. Basically, what it's going to do is suck out the magic that causes your skin to change color, but you'll die in the process. And with the magic provided by you, I can channel the energy to use it to take over the world. Wow, that is an evil plan. A really evil plan that I wasn't expecting. And all I have to do is turn it on. That is one evil face. Oh, she's turned it on. The magic has been sucked. Now I just need 30 seconds. This is the police. Put your hands where I can see them. I love how the policewoman came in with a karate kick. <laughs> <laughs> so dramatic and unnecessary. Yes, girl, arrest her. Ha, you fool. You can't disable it when it's already started. Bye-bye. There's a dramatic fight scene happening. The boyfriend has come in. That was so dramatic. I wasn't expecting it. Everybody's waiting at the hospital. She survived, but she doesn't have that much energy left in her body. It'll take her about two to three weeks to recover. But after that, she'll be fine to go. Everyone's come to see her. Oh, that's really sweet of them. Even her ex came and her boy friend of course. You're awake and your skin, you're healed. Everyone is so happy and she gets to have her ice cream. What do you want Leo? I just wanted to tell you the truth. I didn't have any intention of cheating on you. We got a flashback. Traffic wasn't as bad as I thought but I'm 10 minutes early. I'll just wait for Mia then. Why is he wearing two watches? Who needs that? Uh-oh, here she comes. The evil boyfriend stealing gacha character. Hey, babe. Mia, you don't look like yourself. You kind of look like the bully girl from school. I wanted to try a new look. I wanted to be pretty like her. You don't need to change. But I want to. Then... I support you. Are you telling me he thought it was Mia? How? How dumb can you be? You know, I've been wanting to kick our relationship up a notch for a while. I realize that we have a special connection and I'm never gonna let you go. So? Oh, it was an evil plan. I can't believe that plan actually worked, but it did. Why me? Mia, I can't believe that you fooled me. I've lost the only girl I loved. Please don't leave me. I am helpless. I don't care. Did you know that I'm a Yandere? I can kill her faster than you can get to her. And no one would believe you if you told them that I killed her. Because everyone adores me and would think that I would never do that. But I'll leave her alone if we can do one thing. What's that? We have a baby. I would never do that to Mia. Okay. 
I'll kill her then. Fine, I'll do it. What? This is insane. She's scary. I don't like her at all. And that's what happened. Leo, I had no idea. I'm sorry, but I've already moved on. As long as you're happy. I will never stop loving you though. Thank you for the memories and good luck with your little boy. I am so sorry for everything that I've ever done to you. I forgive you. We are seven months into the future. I know we've only been together for a year, but I don't want to lose you again. So, will you, Mia Rachel Johnson, marry me? Yes, 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 a million times. Even though we're only in high school and that's a bad idea. Gotcha logic. But guys, that is where this story has ended and my goodness, was it the most dramatic gacha story I think I've ever read in my life. If you did enjoy it, do make sure to leave a like on it and if you want to watch another video of mine, you can click here and let's go watch it together.